The pursuing officer chased the suspect, and as the suspect made an exaggerated movement and appeared to reach for an unknown object, the officer believed the subject had a weapon and fired at the suspect, subsequently striking a 41-year-old Milwaukee man who was in close proximity. Now this all unfolded overnight near 26th and West Hour Avenue. That's where 12 News' Shanae Amara leads off our big story coverage. You can still see some police tape left behind here, but this is the house that driver ran into. Now, I spoke briefly with the family who lives here. They are upset because the police came into their house and shot someone they weren't chasing after. You always heard, mm. then they say, no, they come back again. Mm. That sound of police chasing after a speeding car around 1 o'clock Sunday morning got Morris Virgil's attention. That, that person was riding for a while. Mm -hmm. They was chasing him for a while. He expected to hear a screeching stop instead. Bam! You know, it was just, a, just a shot. But police didn't shoot the driver. Chief Alfonso Morales tells 12 News the 22-year-old driver backed into a squad and ran into a nearby house. When officers followed, they say he reached for something police thought was a weapon. An officer fired, hitting another man nearby. Uh, I just hate that that uh, situation turned out like, like it did. The wrong person got shot, yeah. you know. And uh, we got to control our emotions on both sides, mm -hmm. the police too, because they get frustrated because they can't catch a person. It's not clear if the driver knew the victim, but one neighbor who didn't want his face shown believes police are impulsive in his neighborhood. They try to basically pull the gun out on everybody over here. They, I don't know what they're scared of. Virgil says the blame shouldn't just be with police, but also those who put others in danger. You know, because there's too many angry people on both sides. Mm -hmm. There's got to be solutions, you know, instead of keep compounding the problem. In Milwaukee, Shirley Mara, WISN 12 News. Officers arrested the driver they were chasing. Police say the man the officer shot has non-life-threatening injuries. That officer is, a, is 27 years old with a year and a half on the force. He's on administrative duty tonight. Now, 12 News asked Milwaukee police several more questions, including if the suspect ended up having a gun, if there's any connection between the suspect and the man who was shot, and if offers, officers followed proper protocol. A spokesperson did not answer those questions, saying they will be answered in a community briefing. Chief Morales says that briefing will happen within 45 days.